Hey there, my name is Nicole Waddington and today I'm going to show you how to add image assets to your Google campaigns. So first off, what is an image asset? Image assets are visuals that you can upload and attach to your search campaigns in order to make your ads more visually appealing in the SERPs, hopefully to increase click-through rate and engagement on your ad. So benefits include driving performance, conveying information visually about your product or service, and they also extend to the new platforms to reach more customers because you can serve them on YouTube search via the search partner network. So when your image appears next to a search ad, potential customers are shown your headline, your descriptions, your URL, and the images that you provide. But there's some requirements in order to use image assets. The first is your account has to be open for more than 60 days. Your account has to have good history of policy compliance. Your account has to have active campaigns and active text ads that have accrued spending on search campaigns for at least the last 28 days. And finally, the account has to be in an eligible vertical or sub-vertical. What kind of images can you use for image assets? You can use square images or landscape, which are optional but recommended. File format has to be PNG or JPEG. And one thing to note too is if your ads are serving on mobile, you may have three square images side by side show up with your search ad or one square image alone. On desktop, you can have one square image, one landscape image with your search ad. You could have five square images side by side, two landscape images side by side, or one landscape and three square side by side. I know that's a lot, but all in all, we recommend you add square and landscape that can fit and serve together or as a singular image to your search ads, just in case the combination gets mixed up and um, multiple images are shown together. So how to add image assets. Let's get into the Google Ads platform. So on the left-hand side, you can go under campaigns, assets, and then assets again. And then you're taken to an overview of all the assets in your account. And when we want to add a new asset, we can click the plus sign here and then select image. So then it's going to ask you to select the campaigns you want to apply to. So I'm going to select this search campaign. And you can add images to the campaign or a specific ad group. Um, for this example, we'll add it to just the campaign. And then I'm going to upload four different images. Um, you also have the option to select from your asset library. So say you've already uploaded some images that you want to use as an asset, you can pre-select um, in the asset library. So I'm going to go ahead and import my images from my computer. Go to upload, upload from computer, and then import these four. Oh my gosh, it's taking forever. All right, so once your images upload to the asset library, you can select which ones you like to, you'd like to add to the campaigns and it's gonna ask you to crop either square and or landscape. So for this one here, um, I'm gonna do a square crop and I'll also provide a landscape and I can select these two ratios. And I'm just gonna do that with all of the images. You can add up to 20 images. Like I said before, um, providing different ratios and a variety of images um, is always recommended because the Google algorithm might mix and match some of the images you provide. So once we have all of our images cropped and selected, you can press save and then save to the campaign. So after you've added your image assets, here's where you can see your performance of each image. So if you go to campaigns, assets, and then assets again, on the left sidebar, you can adjust your date range to see the performance of your image assets. And then if you select just images and scroll all the way down, you get your table of the image and you can see impressions, cost, clicks, conversion rate, conversions, all your usual metrics. 
And then say you want to pause or remove an image, all you do is go to the left-hand side of the image and select that drop down and you can pause or remove images at any time. All right, there you have it. That's how you apply image assets to your Google Ads campaigns. If you like this content and want more marketing tutorials or marketing news, consider subscribing to Marketing O'Clock YouTube channel or check out our podcast that comes out every week on Friday that covers SEO, PPC, social media news, and more.